Hi right, guys, Gav here with some crack of dawn inspiration. Uh, today, well recently, uh, um, uh, I got that uh, good book uh, connected to the the archetypes. So the male archetypes in particular um, I've also been working a lot with uh, fairy tales recently so it's very much connected to that and the last couple of days I've been working on the inner king in relationship to adulthood and uh, what tends to happen in modern males and uh, females as well but there's a whole different uh, thing is um, is we don't come into our full uh, adulthood and that is the taking responsibility and working with uh, the right uh, relationship to healthy, um, particularly structures in one's life. So, yeah, I wanted to share that with you because uh, when you think about it, the king archetype in our age, it's not just the <clears throat> It's not just this kind of the normal aspect of it. This it's a love uh, king aspect. So it's a heart heart king, and it's very much connected to uh, Leo. But also um, in a structural aspect or truth aspect, it's connected very much to. Um, Saturn is this king of uh, structure and relationship to weight and lightness. So it can go down into the into the death um, and up into and from that it can create this kind of foundation of uh, of uh, life. And it's very much connected to community in our age. And then you've got the joy structure. The joy structure is very much connected to this king um, relationship to Jupiter. Um, Jupiter, of course, rules uh, Sagittarius and Pisces. And that, um, so the king of those aspects is one of them is to, uh, in relationship to Pisces, is to be able to uh, con control your feeling in the way that you want to get kind of what you want. And that's done through this direction and thinking. Um, yeah, so inspired thinking it's kind of like when you you connect when you connect with uh, Jupiter in this way it's one of the doorways to it is uh, that I use is through the sycamore tree which is quite often used for musical instruments because it has this kind of light structure to it um, it's yeah so just wanted to share that because it's a it's a really helpful exercise to work with. A lot of coaches use it um, in their work, and it's definitely something that I maybe wish I'd done a wee bit earlier. But yeah, it's good to do it any time work with it 
Anyway, that's all for today. Have a good day. Bye for now.